basically same levels but also has some levels from the Battle Out of Hell DLC I know that or expansion pack it does have some levels from that one as well so thrown in so it's weird that it has levels from that but doesn't have levels some levels from the original game which are pretty cool and uh, yeah the, the story is something like you have to do this yet again you have to get ho however many million souls or something like that and then go and uh, do it and then you go through all these levels well some of these levels again and then that's how the game works really it's, I, I can't remember much of the story but it's pretty much the same just a little bit differently so it's like a reimagination but but also keeping in mind that the original game already happened I believe probably I think so and I think that's how it works that it already happened but it happens again I think but I'm I'm not quite sure anymore What do you mean? I mean, never. Okay. This is well started. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Uh. No? And this is how it continues the story. We look completely different now. <laughs> so yeah, two minutes later we look completely different and now we're fighting them. <laughs> Noticing the important details. I suppose that's some sort of a portal. Yeah, no more. Uh Yeah, no more uh, boobies only covered by hair. Stay back, or I'll kill you where you stand. Huh? Hey, sister, watch where you point that thing. Sorry, I, I thought you were Alistair. Yeah, I got that. That was a pretty good trick back there, by the way saved our asses where'd you learn to do that later it looks like we're not any closer to my our goal than we were before and just what is our goal at this point to eliminate alistair before his armies can attack purgatory but now that he knows we're after him that's just gotten a whole lot harder and i suppose that's my fault don't be ridiculous nobody samael lucifer alistair or even me thought you'd make it this far. Quite an achievement for someone so new to the afterlife. Yeah, but 
are not good enough. I need to take Alistair down before he can mass his attack. I don't think so, I get rearmed, I need you to get me back into hell so I can make Alistair pay for what he's done to you and to me and what he's about to do to all the souls. Also, now we're a famous rapper because there we're like no waving around with our hands like we're rapping. The only gate was in the monastery. And that's gone. Famous rap rap Why rapper. Just do that little trick of yours again. That little trick, as you call it, only works one way. <laughs> what idiot would want to find a way into hell? Damn it, Eve. I know that Alistair and his forces aren't gonna sit still. I didn't put that big of a dent in his army. He was gonna mount an attack on Purgatory, and I don't see any reason why those plans should have changed. My precious! He's not gonna attack unless there's a back door like for the, his the, armies to retreat through. His stance is like... They're cowards. Yeah. Cowards you know what I'm talking about. Out. I'm betting that by intercepting... You're my precious! ...come through into Purgatory, Hold off his invasion long enough to find that door. Then I'll show Alistair the meaning of torture and pain. Thing is, he knows I'm still here, and it's a sure bet he won't set foot in any place I've been before. He won't take me on unless he has the whole field. Nice, Jack. <laughs> You've been here a lot longer than I have. You must have some idea where Alistair might send his advanced troops. Show me. <sighs> There's so many places. Here, the orphanage. Orphanage? There are children in purgatory? Of course. The souls of the young are generally... There's so many places here. They hang in the balance, and therefore end up trapped in purgatory. I think the the lips are probably synced to Polish uh, dubbing. Remain here for all eternity. Many of them congregated the orphanage. Why would Alistair's minions be the souls of children? Alistair will find many willing followers there, and you'd best not think of them as children. Okay, then it's just basically synced to. If we wait until morning, if we wait until morning, it might be too late to start. <laughs> I know Alistair won't wait. Sink to sink language, maybe. Anyway. This is a battle. <laughs> Daniel. If you do manage to kill him, don't let any of his minions near him. Anything that comes into contact with him before his life energy is dissipated might absorb his power and take his place. You'll find yourself facing a new ruler of hell if that happens. These legit look worse. <laughs> if I take this guy almost looks like Alan Wake now. When it's over. If not, there's also interlacing on the video. I don't know if you noticed it, but lot of time for regret. somehow there's a bit of interlacing in some movements. Pretty epic. Good job. Let's see who, who made this thing. So original game made by um, People Can Fly. Let's see. Wait, there's a film? What the fuck? On August 1st, 2007, producing company Guy walks into a bar announced they had acquired the film rights to Painkiller and had begun pre-production. Pre John Berg and Todd Komarniki would act as producers. There, was, there has been no additional word on the film, presumably cancelled. Well, no shit, 10 years ago. Battle Out of Hell is done by. <coughs> I saw like a list 
a while back. When oh, there we go. It's oh wait, battle letter fell is still done by people can fly. Hmm. Okay, never mind. So it's actually the same developer as the main game. And Pinkiller Overdose is done by Mind of Air Studios. Pinkiller Resurrection is done by Homegrown Games. Pinkiller Redemption is done by Ectooth Team. And Pinkiller Recurring Evil is done by Med Art. Shade Art. Okay. So, five expansions. One of which is done by the original developers and four are just done by someone else. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that's ten levels. Darth Vader is in the game. Yeah, I did realize that on, like halfway through, but I I wanted to roll with it. I didn't, um, you know. Sh 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 shut up, Ethan. Oh, nice. I bet there's some secret there. Oh, hang on. Oh, hey, look, I have 150 health, so that means I actually carry my my uh, stuff over. I have my tarot cards, I think, probably, because I have 150 health, and that's one of my tarot cards. Just turned up because of the cutscene. Turn it up because cutscenes are quieter. What the fuck is that? Can I make it over? Here. Ammo. And you know what? I don't have any fucking weapons though. So that's great. Ammo pack for no fucking weapons whatsoever. Woo, lad! What an expansion pack. That was worth it. If I find a weapon, I'll have ammo for it. Who knows? 
Oh, probably not. I guess if I went back to the the map and then started again, I would get the same glitch and get all the weapons maybe with no ammo. There's no music yet, not sure. There's probably gonna be music once I enter. Well, actually... What the fuck are these? Is, it, is, like, is this like kids cut in half? Yeah, this seems like it. <clears throat> there might be no music in this one, actually. Unless it's gonna just play now. Hey, ammo for my non-existent gun. Yay. Memes. What the fuck? Ooh, is this poopy house here? Poopy orphanage. Spoops. Spoopsicle. Ooh, a ball. Nice colored ball. Yeah, there's no metal music anymore. They decided to go with some. What is this? Yeah, something, something else. <laughs> I'm not sure what that is. Oh, the piggy bank. The big piggy bank has money in it. That's actually fairly realistic. Oh shit! The fuck is this? Did I should play some uh, Metallica since we're really close to hell, Brazil. Um. I don't like Metallica anymore. Okay, I have to say the sound design for this game is probably better. I really enjoyed the the metal. So like it, it, I don't know. For me, the metal soundtrack is just kind of part of the game. I wouldn't remove it or anything. But it's actually quite nice. Like, it's a quite nice of a change that this one opted to using ambient and some some mild music instead of the heavy metal and it's still done by the same Polish metal heads this is such, I have such deja vu I feel like I've done this before maybe, I think maybe this level is actually in the hell and damnation I've never actually played this expansion pack I only played the original painkiller so back in the day I never played this so I, I suppose it's probably in Hell and Damnation and that's where I know it from. Dude, I don't have any weapons. Like, uh, I got all this ammo. Can I do something with it? No. Oh, hey, there's a gun. Oh, nice. That's what you needed to do. There quite quite a few shots. Yeah, true. The town music from Painkiller is still one of my favorites in the game. <clears throat> oh 
I wanted to ask you, Ethan, uh, how much do you know about Heretic? I was always wondering why the heck is there Heretic and then Hexen beyond Heretic and then Hexen 2 and then Heretic 2. What the fuck? That's so confusing. And Heretic 2 is like a third person action game, whereas all the other games are FPS. And it's also done by the same people, apparently. It's all Ravenshaft. I thought it would be like uh, a different studio made the Heretic 2 because they had the rights or something. <clears throat> Where am I going? Oh, down there. Nice little orphanage here. I like the uh, atmosphere. The kids probably really enjoy staying here. Ooh, teddy bear. Dude, these fucking things take a lot of hits. <laughs> yeah, I should Omega. They're saying, Stop it! Get into the fucking classroom! <coughs> what do you mean the first level already beats entire stand alone? You? What are you talking about? Are you spooked? Bitpo, is that it? Are you are you are you a little crybaby? You spooped? You completely pooped your pants? It's a different approach. Holy shit dude, these explode. It exploded it, Papa. Yeah, I imagine being spooked by a, a dating sim done by none other than Man and Fuck. <laughs> One good jump scare. Are you saying this because we finally get to kill little little kids? Fitpo, is that it? Oh shit! That was a bad idea. If 
Defense AI. Can you not kill it or what? up all the souls I think. What the fuck? Dude. What the shit? What the fuck? Okay, I probably can't kill it just yet. I need to like do something special for him. down here. Nope. Oh shit. He stayed there. Let's go down. Go down. Thank you for the host, Benno Bram. Welcome to the cast. Ben's Gamers. Hey, what the shit do you do with this? Oh, hey. I think he took damage. Did he? I'm not sure. Oh, okay. He died at it. Kappa. I mean, you can just watch it in full screen or you can hide the chat, Ethan. Wait, oh yeah, I can't even fight it. What am I doing? kill it or what? With fire? No. Um. I don't think it's ever gonna happen, Shadar. What the fuck? What? Yo! 
Oh wait. It's actually oh, it's not what the fuck? Wait, what? I don't understand. This game is too cryptic. I forgot to what I forgot to check even what the bonus thing was. Never get hurt, but <laughs> never. Are you fucking kidding me? Do this without getting hurt? <laughs> you what? I don't think that's a likely possibility. Looney Park. I mean, Twitch has a lot of issues with a lot of things. Well, let's see what this is. Yeah, I just gotta get good. I forgot to change the game. On Twitch. This expansion is perfect. I mean, it's pretty alright so far. It also breaks up the formula, formula enough to feel different than the original game. Okay, actually the sort of the metal is back. It's it's a little bit different sounding, but it sounds more electric than than uh, actual uh, instrumental. Oh, for fuck's sake, my video card. God damn it, dude. Uh, don't mind the uh, the graphical glitches. I think I googled what, what what was wrong and then he's been using that fix since. Well, I mean, I don't 
don't know if he even streams anymore. I don't follow him. Well, this can only be fixed by restarting a computer, but I don't want to anymore. Well, I could also just freeze and then come back. That, that also fixes it somehow. Okay, it might happen now. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, come on, do it. Do it! Oh, we're not gonna do it. I know. It. I, mean, I don't know why it does that, but sometimes it just goes real bad and then freezes and then comes back and it's fine. But it's not doing it right now. For some reason. Oh well. Yeah, it's for like our something series video cards from AMD. Huh? It's getting kind of bad here. Like you can see the red dots. Come on. Come on. Do it. Ah, I can't. I don't know. It's more like, uh, I think it's not GPU, it's, it's memory. Because the way this works is that it combines this is a 512 megabyte video card I'm not sure how high it's running right now um, oh there we go it's gonna fix it now 143 megabytes it shouldn't share it yet so like s sometimes why I thought it happened is because it uses DDR1 system memory and then it would um, <coughs> It would actually have issues sharing DDR1 and 3 at the same time and using it as video memory if it runs out of the 512. So I thought that's why it happens, but I'm not sure anymore. Never had this issue in the Core 2 Duo PC, but I've always had this issue in two weaker systems that I use this card in. So it's really weird, I'm not sure why it happens. But in a stronger PC it never happened. Only in this only in these older ones. It could also be a problem with PCI Express 1. I'm not sure, because this pretty sure this motherboard uses PCI Express 1 and the card is to PCI Express 2. Could be that as well. Like as in Gen 1 versus Gen 2, that's what I meant. So hello Zoki, welcome to the cast. Eh, 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 eh. Dude, ammo! Ammo! Oh, for fuck's sake. Ouch. I just did that to get 69 health. There's health too. Oh! Almost killed myself here. I don't think I'm gonna be getting that. Kill no more than 88 enemies. Okay.
I can kill like 10 more enemies. That wasn't me. Anything. They all would have died anyways. survive this even without killing any more enemies I can kill like four more one two three four. Oh yeah no more I can't kill any more if I do then I won't get the tarot card. <laughs> well, we'll see. There might be some unavoidable ones. Or I might just die here. Uh, please end it already. When is it gonna end? 5 health, I'm dead. Dude, how are you supposed to survive this thing? What the fuck, really? Okay, fuck this, this is not doable. Fuck it. I'm just gonna start, start killing people. Probably at the end of it too, so that sucks, but whatever. I wish I can turn into demon while I'm riding this thing.
Uh, I'm tired. I'm gonna go off. I'll continue this whenever. I don't know. Thank you for watching. Um, let's see. Hmm. Why isn't there anyone streaming? For fuck's sakes. I've already beat Painkiller. This is Battle Out of Hell. There's... Eight more levels. And then other deals, uh, other expansions. We killed Lucifer in hell. No, we decided to go after Eve because Lucifer uh, rob uh, kidnapped her and instead of going to heaven to Catherine, we decided to go to hell with uh, to to uh, Eve, Eve, and then. We fought Lucifer and then the other folks down there wanted to take over anyway, so then they started attacking us and then Eve got us out of there, back into purgatory. And now we're doing stuff to, to stop the hell Hell's army so they can't attack uh, purgatory. Why is Pass still playing on his old computer? Didn't he get his new PC yet? Dude, like, his essay is running at 10 FPS. Didn't he get a new computer yet? Oh, what the fuck? I don't understand. Mm, whatever, maybe he's... I thought he, he got it, like, last weekend. He's still using the old PC to stream. Hmm... San Andreas old missions? <laughs> no. Uh, Mega Man Ace. That's actually pretty cool. Cool kid is doing Mega Man Ace. I'm gonna go ahead and host him again. Like yesterday. <laughs> I don't care. Mega Man Ace is actually interesting to see. My, my, my hands right. Thanks for watching again. And uh, see you all when I see you. I don't, I don't know if I'll stream tomorrow. We'll see. Goodbye. Good night. Mm. I don't have to experience